Hello, dear brothers and sisters. It is a pleasure to welcome you to another powerful psalm that inspires and strengthens us. Today, we will delve into Psalm 96, an inexhaustible source of comfort and faith. I invite you to join me on this journey of reflection and spiritual renewal. Let's explore together the depths of this psalm and discover the transformative truths it offers us. Psalm 96, a resplendent ode to the glory and majesty of God, is a poignant call to universal worship and adoration. Composed as a lyrical masterpiece within the Book of Psalms, this sacred text resonates with timeless reverence and awe-inspiring imagery, inviting all humanity to join in a symphony of praise. Its verses, woven with poetic elegance, stir the soul and awaken a deep sense of reverence for the Creator of the heavens and the earth. At its core, Psalm 96 serves as a proclamation of the sovereignty of God over all creation. It extols His unmatched greatness and unrivaled power, emphasizing His supremacy above all other gods and idols. With fervent exhortation, the psalmist calls upon every corner of the earth to lift up their voices in harmonious worship, declaring the name of the Lord with songs of adoration and thanksgiving. The psalmist's exhortation to sing a new song signifies not merely a call for novelty, but rather an invitation to continually renew one's praise and devotion to God. It encapsulates the idea of fresh expressions of worship that resonate with the ever-unfolding revelations of God's character and deeds. This new song becomes a testament to the living, dynamic relationship between the Creator and His creation one that is characterized by ongoing wonder and awe. Furthermore, Psalm 96 underscores the universal scope of God's reign and the inclusivity of His salvation. It transcends cultural and ethnic boundaries, calling upon all nations and peoples to join in the chorus of praise. Through vivid imagery, the psalmist paints a picture of creation itself joining in the symphony of worship. From the heavens above to the earth below, from the seas to the fields, and from the forest to the mountains. All of creation is summoned to proclaim the glory of God with resounding joy and jubilation. Ultimately, Psalm 96 resounds with a prophetic anticipation of the day when God will come to judge the earth with righteousness and faithfulness. It points to a future culmination of God's redemptive purposes where justice will be established and all creation will rejoice in His righteous reign. In its entirety, Psalm 96 stands as a timeless anthem, inspiring believers throughout the ages to lift their voices in praise and proclaim the matchless glory of the Lord to all the ends of the earth. Psalm 96, a radiant hymn celebrating the magnificence and splendor of the divine, emerges as a vibrant call to global adoration and reverence. Set within the pages of the sacred book of Psalms, this profound composition resonates with enduring reverence and captivating imagery beckoning all humanity to partake in a symphony of worship. Its verses, adorned with poetic grace, evoke profound awe and awaken a deep-seated reverence for the Creator of the heavens and the earth. Central to Psalm 96 is the exaltation of God's unrivaled sovereignty over the cosmos. It extols His boundless greatness and matchless power, emphasizing His supremacy above every other deity and idol. With fervent exhortation, the psalmist implores every corner of the globe to unite in lifting their voices in harmonious worship, proclaiming the name of the Lord with hymns of adoration and gratitude. The psalmist's invocation to sing a fresh melody denotes not merely a call for novelty, but rather an urging to continually renew one's praise and allegiance to God. It encapsulates the notion of perpetually offering fresh expressions of worship that resonate with the ever-unfolding revelations of God's character and deeds. This novel melody serves as a testament to the dynamic, living relationship between the Creator and His creation, marked by perpetual wonder and awe. Moreover, Psalm 96 underscores the expansive dominion of God's rule and the inclusiveness of His deliverance. It transcends cultural and ethnic boundaries, beckoning all nations and peoples to join in the chorus of praise. Through vivid imagery, the psalmist portrays creation itself joining in the symphony of worship, from the expanse of the heavens to the depths of the earth, from the oceans to the plains, and from the woodlands to the peaks. Every facet of creation is summoned to herald the glory of God with resounding joy and exuberance. 
Ultimately, Psalm 96 resounds with prophetic anticipation of the day when God will come to adjudicate the earth with equity and fidelity. It points to a future culmination of God's redemptive design, where righteousness will be established and all creation will exult in His just reign. In its entirety, Psalm 96 stands as an ageless anthem, inspiring believers throughout epochs to raise their voices in praise and proclaim the unparalleled splendor of the Lord to the furthest reaches of the earth. Now we will meditate on Psalm 96, and then we will say a prayer, and then we will pray the Our Father. Sing to the Lord a new song. Sing to the Lord, all the earth. Sing to the Lord, praise His name. Proclaim His salvation day after day. Declare His glory among the nations, His marvelous deeds among all peoples. For great is the Lord and most worthy of praise. He is to be feared above all gods. For all the gods of the nations are idols. But the Lord made the heavens. Splendor and majesty are before Him. Strength and glory are in His sanctuary. Ascribe to the Lord, all you families of nations. Ascribe to the Lord glory and strength. Ascribe to the Lord the glory due His name. Bring an offering and come into His courts. Worship the Lord in the splendor of His holiness. Tremble before Him, all the earth. Say among the nations, the Lord reigns. The world is firmly established, it cannot be moved. He will judge the peoples with equity. Let the heavens rejoice, let the earth be glad. Let the sea resound, and all that is in it. Let the fields be jubilant, and everything in them. Let all the trees of the forest sing for joy. Let all creation rejoice before the Lord, for He comes. He comes to judge the earth. He will judge the world in righteousness, and the peoples in His faithfulness. My Lord and Heavenly Father, grant this person strength to overcome life's difficulties, especially those caused by rejection from relatives and friends. Renew your energy, Lord, and bring new energy to these people. We know that you are holy and that we depend entirely on you. Lord, my God and my Father, I recognize that many people are facing difficulties in their lives. There are those who are burdened with debt and others who seem to be stuck in a stagnant situation with no progress. However, I trust you to bless us all. I ask that you bring prosperity to your sons and daughters who face such challenges. May you unlock the paths that seem closed and bring new opportunities. Lord, extend your hands of help to each of them, in the name of Jesus. Amen. Almighty Lord, in your infinite mercy and love, I cry out for your abundant blessings upon us all. Do not allow, Heavenly Father, your children to become discouraged or give up in the face of life's adversities. Pour your divine strength upon us, renew our hopes, and give new encouragement to our lives. We recognize, Lord, that we often find ourselves stuck in situations that don't seem to change, year after year. We feel stuck, stagnant in a cycle that doesn't change. But, Lord, we know that in you there is power to transform any reality. Therefore, we ask you, kind God, to intervene in our lives, breaking these chains that bind us and prevent us from moving forward. May your divine light illuminate our path, showing us new opportunities and directions. May your powerful hand guide us out of stagnation and lead us towards growth and the realization of your plans for us. Grant us, Lord, discernment to see the necessary changes in our lives and courage to make them. Bless, Lord, each person present here who reads these words with a heart open to your will. You know, O oh Father, the struggles and difficulties that each one faces. Therefore, we beseech you, Lord, to bring hope where there is despair, to bring comfort where there is pain, to grant peace where there is anguish. May each of us be strengthened in our faith, fully trusting in your providence and unconditional love. May our lives be living testimonies of your transforming power, Lord, so that others may also be reached by your grace and mercy. In you we place our trust, Lord, and we lift this prayer with gratitude in our hearts. May your blessings accompany us in every step, today and always. My God and my Heavenly Father, I humbly come into your presence to implore your blessings upon your children. Let there be no shortage of daily bread, Lord, as we trust in you to provide abundantly. Look with compassion at those who are distressed and worried, who cannot find peace or sleep because of debts and other problems. 
Intervene, Lord, in favor of your children, taking measures in their lives. Bless, Lord, your daughter who cries for help today. Hear her pleas and strengthen her faith. She hears the prayers of all who cry out to you at this time, and may there not be a lack of your blessing in their lives. Deliver them from all the snares of the spiritual enemy, O Lord, and fill them with your peace that passes all understanding. May each one feel the touch of your love and the certainty of your constant presence. In the name of Jesus, Lord God, Heavenly Father, I come before you to pray your blessings upon your children. Let there be no lack of daily sustenance, as we trust in your abundant provision. Look with compassion on those distressed and worried, unable to find peace or sleep due to debts and other problems. Intervene on behalf of your children, taking action in their lives. Bless your daughter who cries for help today. Hear your supplications and strengthen your faith. Hear the prayers of all who cry out to you at this time, and may your blessing be constant in their lives. Deliver them from all the snares of the spiritual enemy and grant them your supernatural peace. May each one feel your love and the certainty of your presence. In the name of Jesus, Heavenly Father, I stand before your presence to beseech your blessings upon your beloved sons and daughters. May you never lack daily provision as we fully trust in your kindness and constant care. Look with mercy on those who are afflicted and anxious, unable to find tranquility due to worries about debts and other adversities. Intervene, O oh Lord, in their lives, acting with your sovereign power to bring relief and solution to their problems. May your daughter who cries for help today be enveloped by your peace and strengthened in her faith. Grant, compassionate Father, the petitions of all who cry out to you at this time, and may your blessing be poured out upon them abundantly. Free them from all the wiles of the spiritual enemy and grant them the tranquility that only you can offer. May each one deeply experience the love that you emanate and the unshakable certainty of your constant presence. In the name of Jesus, Heavenly God, I stand before your presence to beg your blessings upon your beloved sons and daughters. May you never lack daily provision as we fully trust in your kindness and constant care. Look with mercy on those who are afflicted and anxious, unable to find tranquility due to worries about debts and other adversities. Intervene, O oh Lord, in their lives, acting with your sovereign power to bring relief and solution to their problems. May your daughter who cries for help today be enveloped by your peace and strengthened in her faith. Grant, compassionate Father, the petitions of all who cry out to you at this time, and may your blessing be poured out upon them abundantly. Free them from all the wiles of the spiritual enemy and grant them the tranquility that only you can offer. May each one deeply experience the love that you emanate and the unshakable certainty of your constant presence. In the name of Jesus, I come before your majesty to plead for your gracious blessing upon your beloved sons and daughters. May they never lack daily sustenance as we fully trust in your generosity and constant care. Look with compassion at those who face anguish and anxieties, unable to find peace due to worries about debt and other adversities. Intervene, O oh Lord, in their lives, manifesting your sovereign power to bring comfort and solution to their problems. May your daughter who cries for help today be enveloped by your peace and strengthened in her faith. Answer, O oh loving Father, the petitions of all who cry out to you at this time, and may your blessing reach them abundantly. Free them from all the traps of the spiritual enemy and grant them the security that only you can offer. May each one feel deeply the warmth of your love and the certainty of your constant presence. In the name of Jesus, may the blessing of the Lord rest upon everyone, protecting them from all evil and the snare of the enemy. May all evil strategies be undone and may any trap be nullified by the light of his presence. We ask the Lord to remove all anguish, fear, affliction and anxiety that may plague hearts, replacing them with peace that surpasses all understanding. May every burden on the body, every negative energy, and every spiritual weight be dissipated by His grace and restorative power. In the name of Jesus, we trust in His promise of deliverance and healing, placing our faith in His ability to transform every situation for the good of those who love Him. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, that will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. 
and forgive us our debts, as we also have forgiven our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory forever. Amen. Glory to God. In conclusion, Psalm 96 stands as a resplendent testament to the eternal majesty and boundless glory of the Almighty. Its verses, woven with the finest threads of poetic eloquence, transcend the confines of time and space, inviting every soul to partake in the divine symphony of worship. Through its exhortations and imagery, this sacred psalm echoes across the ages, beckoning humanity to recognize the sovereignty of God, to lift their voices in unison praise, and to embrace the transformative power of divine encounter. As we contemplate the profound depths of Psalm 96, we are reminded of the enduring relevance of its message in our lives today. In a world beset by turmoil and uncertainty, this psalm serves as a beacon of hope and a call to steadfast faith. It reminds us that amidst the chaos of life, there remains a steadfast anchor in the unchanging character of God, a God whose glory surpasses all earthly powers and whose love endures forever. Furthermore, Psalm 96 challenges us to embrace a posture of continual renewal and transformation in our worship and devotion. It calls us to sing a new song, not merely in the sense of novelty, but in the spirit of ongoing renewal and revival. It urges us to approach God with hearts open to His ever-unfolding revelations, ready to be transformed by the beauty of His presence and the wonder of His works. Moreover, this psalm compels us to embrace a vision of inclusivity and unity in our worship. It reminds us that the praise of God knows no bounds, transcending barriers of culture, ethnicity, and language. In the symphony of worship, every voice finds its place, every heart finds its home, and every soul finds its purpose in the adoration of the one who created and sustains all things. Ultimately, Psalm 96 points us towards a future hope, a day when God's righteousness will reign supreme and His justice will be established throughout the earth. It calls us to live in anticipation of that glorious day, working tirelessly to usher in God's kingdom of love, peace, and justice here and now. As we meditate on the timeless truths of Psalm 96, may our hearts be stirred to ever deeper levels of devotion and adoration. May we join our voices with the chorus of creation, singing praises to the one who is worthy of all honor and glory, both now and forevermore. Amen. In conclusion, Psalm 96 serves as a radiant testament to the eternal majesty and boundless glory of the Almighty. Its verses, intricately woven with poetic elegance, transcend the constraints of time and space, beckoning every soul to participate in the divine symphony of worship. Through its exhortations and vivid imagery, this sacred psalm echoes across the ages, inviting humanity to acknowledge the sovereignty of God, to raise their voices in united praise, and to embrace the transformative power of divine encounter. As we reflect on the profound depths of Psalm 96, we are reminded of the enduring relevance of its message in our lives today. In a world fraught with turmoil and uncertainty, this psalm serves as a guiding light and a call to unwavering faith. It reminds us that amidst life's chaos, there remains an unshakable anchor in the unchanging character of God, a God whose glory surpasses all earthly powers and whose love endures throughout eternity. Furthermore, Psalm 96 challenges us to adopt a stance of continual renewal and transformation in our worship and devotion. It urges us to sing a fresh melody, not simply as a novelty, but as an expression of ongoing revival and rejuvenation. It calls us to approach God with hearts receptive to His ever-unfolding revelations, poised to be transformed by the beauty of His presence and the wonder of His works. Moreover, this psalm compels us to embrace a vision of inclusivity and unity in our worship. It reminds us that the praise of God knows no boundaries, transcending barriers of culture, ethnicity, and language. In the symphony of worship, every voice finds its resonance, every heart finds its sanctuary, and every soul finds its purpose in the adoration of the one who created and sustains all things. Ultimately, Psalm 96 directs our gaze towards a future hope, a day when God's righteousness will reign supreme and His justice will be established throughout the earth. It calls us to live in anticipation of that glorious day, 
laboring diligently to usher in God's kingdom of love, peace, and justice here and now. As we meditate on the timeless truths of Psalm 96, may our spirits be stirred to ever deeper levels of devotion and adoration. May we unite our voices with the symphony of creation, offering praises to the one who is deserving of all honor and glory, both now and for all eternity. Amen.